This is Sutek. Almost. So here I am in the Panzer III IV. Um, I've mentioned in previous videos I like this tank a lot. Uh, it brings so much to the battlefield. I'm in a position, most advanced position on my team, uh, and I'm attempting to suppress uh, the enemy around their cap. So it's going to require me to constantly move. We've got enemy arty, we got unseen uh, TDs, uh, mediums and heavies, uh, taking shots on this ridge. And what I'm trying to do is just keep moving around, keep changing my position, and support that uh, heavy that just moved out in front of me. Oh, excuse me, medium moved out in front of me. Oh, look. Artie. Hey, Artie. Goodbye, Artie. Oh, look at that. There's a Nash horn. Got him. Is he going to move out of the way in time? Uh, another hit. You know, funny part of it is, is if he could see me, he would be toasting me right now. All right, so now we got another TD. Somewhere around there. Anyway, so as you can see on the battle map, uh, we've taken this corner. It looks like my teammates are going to take the other corner, or so I thought. So again, I'm trying to provide scouting and support fire for my team, which, for whatever reason, insist on remaining behind me. And as you can see, it's a close match. Now, theoretically, I could move down, but since I can't see what's in front of me, I'm not about to leave this position. Okay, so there goes a VK-36-0. Nope, not even that. It's another medium making a run for the enemy cap. So I again provide some covering fire for him and uh, start working this T-150. Not sure why I missed that shot, maybe because there was a rock in the way. Well, there's an M6. Yeah. Yep, he squeaked by, so I couldn't see him. Meanwhile, if you notice up in the northwest uh, corner of the map, uh, they've already wiped out our entire force there, so we have no one between them and the cap. Now the situation is becoming very, very dangerous. We either need to drive for the cap, or we need to rush back for the defense. And the scores are still pretty even, so we have a pretty fair chance in this game. Again, I'm going to continue firing, creating pressure on my opponents. You'll notice that we have a medium tank moving down below, so my fire is providing him with an opportunity. But again, look at the tack map. We have one enemy heavy moving laterally and behind us. We have a medium also moving in on our arty. So we need to get into a position where we can take this cap. So I begin the drive forward, realizing that myself and one other teammate are all that's left. There are no arties, so I don't have to worry about that. But there are tanks around their cap. So one shot. Two shots, engine is gone, and three shots. All right, so now I need to get into that cap. Unfortunately, I'm spotted, so I gotta pull back. Now that T-150 that I've been working on all this time is in a position, and I really need supporting fire from that heavy up on the ridge. Meanwhile, my opponents have moved into the cap. So I just need someone to come forward, and eh, it's too late. I can't see them. No one's moving forward. And there are two enemy tanks in the cap. I'm trying to move to change my position so that I'm not spotted. And then perhaps with my camo and binox kicking on, I can provide some level of support and of course, uh, protective fire. Now, that was a dumb shot. I should have just waited until I had a clear shot. Nope. Ain't gonna happen with a 3-4 on an enemy heavy. They reset the cap. I'm really hoping that heavy behind me is doing something. Nope. Not at all. <laughs> so that's ended my game. So at this point I left the garage thinking, well, we've lost it. I just didn't realize how close it was. Because when you see the results, you're suddenly realizing, oh my god, we could have won this. You see the medium down on K23, and you see that heavy up there who just reset the cap. We're ahead three tanks to two. We just need to get that medium to work together with that um, TD in order to win. But 
unfortunately, he was not able to do that. So, as you can see, top of the board, a VK3601, which had reset the cap, uh, for whatever reason, wasn't able to kill that Skoda and get us the victory. We were so damn close, we had the advantage, and for some reason, we couldn't put it away. But anyway, um, talking about the uh, uh, Panzer III IV, it's an excellent tank. Provides great accuracy, good maneuverability. It's just really crappy against heavy tanks, especially Tier Six. So, looking at the battle board and looking at all my shots, I feel I did extremely well. well. Thank you for watching.